follow us on facebook and instagram and do subscribe our youtube and telegram channels now let's start our discussion welcome to english lecture notes today's topic is helma in a doll's house Torvald Helmer is a lawyer who has recently been promoted to bank manager. He is married to Nora Helmer, with whom he has three children. He plays the role of a controlling, dominating man in Nora's life. Torvald delights in his new position at the bank, just as he delights in his position of authority as a husband. He treats Nora like a child. Does not view Nora as an equal but rather as a plaything or doll to be teased and admired. Torvald is overly concerned with his place and status in society and have a great need for social acceptance and approval. Torvald embraces the belief that a man's role in marriage is to protect and guide his wife. He clearly enjoys the custom that Nora needs his guidance. He instructs her He is also eager to teach Nora. Torvald likes to envision himself as Nora's savior. He always calls Nora with affectionate terms like little featherbrain, little squirrel, little skylark, and little scatterbrain. The repetitive use of the word little shows that he sees her more as a child than a wife or an equal. Another important character trait in Torvald is his exalted sense of self. He sees himself as an idealistic, morally upright individual whose morals are unquestionable. He always reassuring Nora that he will protect her and be a savior to her, but when he learns about her deception, he chides her for it, calling her a liar, a hypocrite, and a criminal. He is quick to judge people as it is seen from his judgment of Crockstead. As move in depth of the play, Helmer is not a miser. He preaches to Nora the value of thrift. He gives her some extra money because it is Christmas time and she would need additional funds to celebrate it properly. Apart from urging his wife to be economical in spending money, he takes upon himself the role of a mentor. to her in other ways also for instance he has always advised her not to eat sweets his reason being that they would spoil her teeth although helma seems to be a man in whom the head is more important than the heart yet he is capable of speaking in a romantic and poetic manner about his love for nora helma is really fond of nora He treats her merely as his pet. He thinks she does not have any individuality or any personality. He regards himself as the master in the house and as the man who has to lay down the rules. He expects his wife to follow the rules which he lays down and to conform to his moral ideas and to his opinions. When he goes through Krog Stud's letter revealing Nora's long kept secret, all his love for her collapses. Helmer is typical of many contemporary heads of the family. He is a well-constructed social product, a proud specimen of a middle-class husband. He represents society at large. As a victim of his narrow view of society, Torvald inspires sympathy rather than reproach. It is with final touch of perversion that Ibsen makes the character of Torvald thoroughly reprehensible to the audience. That's all for today. If you want a detailed analysis of the character Nora, watch our video. The link is given in description box. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, please like the video and don't forget to subscribe the channel and also hit the bell icon to get the notification of our coming videos.